Hello and welcome to Home Cook in Spain. Today I'm going to be cooking meatballs with beer. A simple and delicious recipe. So let's begin. Right, so we'll start off by turning this heat on. I'm going to turn it up to number 7 and I'm going to add about 3 tablespoons, 4 tablespoons of good old olive oil and I'm not going to wait for that to heat up I'm just going to directly throw in the meatballs and I want to brown them off, basically seal them all around and today's lunch I'm going to be accompanying it with chips so let's wait for that okay so once the meatballs are browned I'll take them all out put them on the plate for now and in this same oil I'm going to add the onion. It's a medium sized onion, a whole one this time, all finely chopped. And I'll, I'll, um, I'll move it about every now and then. I want it to be nice and soft. Right, so once the onion is nice and soft, I'm going to crumble in a stock cube. This is a vegetable one, meat or chicken one is fine too. I'm also, I'm going to add in, I'm using six small to medium sized carrots, all finely chopped also. And I'm going to add Oi, a can of beer, a whole can of beer, and I'm going to chuck in my meatballs and any juice that's on the plate. And now I'll also add some salt to my own liking. Let's mix this about a bit. Okay, so now I'm going to I'm going to cover it up and I'm going to cook it there on number 7 medium high for 15 minutes. Okay, so 15 minutes have gone by. Oh, this smells good. As you can see, I've got my chips there on the go. Fresh potatoes. I don't use frozen ones anymore. Hey, nothing wrong with them. I love frozen chips. The only thing is, I've come to realize that they're nearly twice the price of fresh ones. Though they are handy to keep in the freezer for an emergency, aren't they? Right, so this... Oh, call that smell. By the way, you may have noticed that my oil from my chips is orangey colour. That's because it's the oil that I used to fry some chorizos and chips the other day. Gives it a nice extra taste. So this has been here for 15 minutes so I'm going to cover it back up again and leave it there for another 15 minutes okay then so the 15 minutes are up and these are ready you can see that the sauce has nicely thickened up so let's serve them up here is today's delicious meatballs cooked in beer I hope that you enjoyed today's recipe video and I look forward to creating my next one. 
Thank you for watching and goodbye.